welcome back to more Cataclysm. Last time we ran away from a whole bunch of zombies and then we decided to take a little break for a while and go have a little bit of a sleep. Not much has really happened since then, other than that I've noticed that we're running low on water and as such we need to look for some more. So our plan for today is to head out southeast and explore some of this town that we haven't been to. Maybe grab some water along the way. Some more first aid kits would help a lot as well. Especially since, you know, we've been getting injured by a whole bunch of stuff. And I don't really like to, you know, play it all risky. Although the whole thing in and of itself is a risk. So I might take a look at these houses to the south east and we'll see what comes of it shall we it is morning i've had a few bits of disconnected sleep i drank some alcohol but for the most part it's a new day of course the day is not entirely up yet that's just another way of saying the sun hasn't risen fully but the visibility is getting better. Have I checked this out? Ah, uh, I don't need any more clothes right now. And there's a weasel on the ground wandering about. And a chicken. Uh, the wildlife is so eccentric this morning. It makes me wonder why the zombies don't go after them. Maybe they're too fast or something. Did I check this out? Sporting goods. We have a wetsuit, lighters, a book about rifles. Radio is not really helpful at all in the least. Knee pads, bikini top, hmm, flashlight might have help some. So we'll just grab that. Take a further look. There's also a cloak, hammer. Hey, another flashlight. That's good. A hockey puck. Not sure what I'm going to do with that. So I guess after all that, I guess I can just grab the bits and pieces. I'm pretty sure protein powder isn't the greatest thing ever. So, grab ourselves another flashlight. You never know when you're going to need another one of those because Batteries seem to be a very scarce commodity. So, just take another look around, see where the... We have a flare, that's no good for us. Where is it? Glow sticks, radios... I'm pretty sure that I saw something else, but... Oh, I guess I could use a heat pack, who knows when that might come in handy. I've offloaded a few of the stuff we gathered last time, so we should be reasonably safe. Okay, we spotted a dog. How that dog's lasted this long, I don't know. Maybe it's grown human and proceeded to steal a whole bunch of stuff. I don't know. So I guess we can consider that looted. radio stations probably aren't going to help me very much and probably could say the same for the electronic store as well so let's take a look at this grocery store to the south what does this dog think of us it tracks us and it's a feral dog of course all it can do is stare at us for a bit it's not going beyond this door once I close it <laughs> so what have we got Malted milk balls, popcorn, a western novel, US Weekly, cookies, someone get Dayquil, what's actually useful? Archery for kids, that might be interesting, might, not necessarily will be though. Caffeinated chewing gum, no oh, we've got plenty of caffeine where I came from. Cat food. Bandages, we could do with bandages. Yeesh, there's a distinct lack of water around here. That's the 
protein powder. There we go. Got some more bandages. What do you think of us now? Nope. He just looks at us for a, for a bit. So, on our map, we'll just note... How about W? No water. Loose it. That seems good enough of our indicator marker to make. Maybe the houses might have some water. So, with that in mind, let's just pull out our crowbar and crunch this door open and close the curtains because you never know when you might spot a few zombies headed your way. Rubber boots and uh, fast noodles. I don't exactly have the resources to actually make use of those. I really should learn how to boil water. <laughs> It's the least I could do. Bifocal glasses. Well, my eyesight hasn't gone that bad yet. Anything here? Nope. What about this room? This must be the bathroom. It's got a towel, some aspirin. Hey, a first aid kit. Just what we needed. And there's water, although it hasn't been filtered or treated, so I wouldn't trust it. Just yet. Pick up some aspirin. Mm. Bottle of disinfectant. There's a sink in the middle of the room for some reason. And I guess that'll be that. Work for it methodically. And we shouldn't have any problems for today. I received a question last time. Well, not last time. On our first video about whether or not this world was generated was a static or a dynamic one, and I probably answered it incorrectly because I was going off the current record, which was a dynamic spawning system. So in case you didn't know, dynamic spawn system in this game means that zombies are generated based on how much noise you make, and as such, they just begin showing up once you're browsed around the town a little, whereas with static, you just get the one-off zombies everywhere. Only issue with that being that, you know, zombies tend to shop near the shelter where you start and I tend to get killed there. Maybe I'll get to static spawn only out of the fact that it might be a bit more of a realistic representation of what's going on. So here we have dust mask, broom, bubble wrap towel, ammonia, popcorn kernels that haven't been cooked, a sewing kit. I guess we could do grab that. And that reminds me to take off my dust mask, as that will just impede my movements. Anything in here? Just another dust mask and bubble wrap. <laughs> and of course, underground is always dark. So we'll need to turn on our flashlight to see what's going on. Baseball bat, switchblade, Incendiary ammunition for a machine gun, maybe. 44 Magnum. Look at all this ammo. I'm not going to use much of this, if any of it. But still, I'm going to see what I should be collecting. Because I do have limited ammunition carrying capabilities. The 38 I definitely use. Don't use this a whole bunch, but it can't hurt to grab a bit. Shotgun bean bags. Oh, I definitely use these. Right, so with nothing more to it, I should probably stop using my flashlight. I know the general layout at least. Anything in here? No, that's where I came through. I should probably close that door. If they're... yeah, the door's closed. Silly me. I wasn't even looking at the right place. Aluminium can of beer, cigarettes, fire extinguisher, winter boots, cell phone, lighter, touring suit. 